That spin and launch is definitely good. It's crazy, isn't it? Yeah. I mean, with all these different weights, you make this whatever you want it to yeah, be yeah. With, the, with the weight configuration. You can do fives around the head if you want to balance it out. There's all sorts of different options. All right, guys, welcome back. So today we're going to have a little fun. Why, <laughs> well, good fun. It's going to be, uh, Mikey actually doesn't know what fully what's in store for him here. But we're going to do some driver testing. During the bracket, um, there was, it was very evident which drivers were doing very well, which was the, the sort of quicker and lower spin ones in the bracket, mm -hmm. doing really, really good. Cobra won out, um, performed great, really consistent throughout, it was a monster in the final. But like we said in the summary, we felt like that PXG Black Ops Tour was so good, so, so good. consistent. And I think we need to dive into that a little bit more today, but we're not just going to stop at the Tour Driver, we're mm. actually going to take a look at the Black Ops standard model. Nice. The one that, uh, as we said, when we came back from our trip to Scottsdale, more tour players are actually gravitating towards the standard model than the tour. Yeah. The tour has been a little bit too low in spin for a lot of players. Um, we are going to set you up on a golf hole, Mikey. We're going to get you to hit your gamer and sort of look at that. And I'm going to fit you into one of the PXG drivers. We have, we have the full bag of weights when it comes to the PXG driver. And the reason is I would bring that out and, and so even bring that up, I actually think the, the standard Black Ops driver might be the most versatile head in 2024. It won't claim. I don't think it really is. I think it's just pure physics. If we look at the adjustment capabilities of the, the heads nowadays, right? Let's take Ping, G4 there, phenomenal driver. Obviously, we love it. The track moves from there to there. Mm -hmm. And the Black Ops were moving it from there to yeah, there, yeah. like true extremes in the Both head. <laughs> and we're getting the full capability of the, the sort of um, the CG positioning. Obviously, carbon on top, carbon on bottom. We now know it's really quick. This one is super low spin. This one is not high spin. And you're right. going to be shocked, yeah, yeah. I think, because when I've been testing this one, like it's so stable. If there's such a driver that has truly high launch and low spin this year, that is it. Really? Wow. It's amazing. So we're going to dive into that. We have, as I say, full uh, gambit of weights to customize it. We've got your shaft in here, and we're going to kind of do a little bit of a fit for one of these two. Because um, you were fit into the tour one, same as me. It was, yeah. And you do spike up and spin a little bit, as I do, mm -hmm. which I think this one still is pretty good. But if we look at, again, from a, a, a center of gravity adjustment standpoint, if we look at just those two, yeah, look, at, wow. look what those weights sort of are able to move. I mean, this this is kind of normal, still good. Yeah. This is extreme. Yeah, max, crazy. Love it. Okay, let's get you uh, let's get you warming up with a few of yours. Long ball. Smashing. Okay, Pebble Beach, the ocean. Yep. The Pacific ringing the ringing in the atmosphere around 18. Hallowed ground. Hallowed ground. You never, played it? Never played it. Not yet. One day. If anyone's watching, Pebble, if you're watching. Give me an invite for the lads. Come on. Oh, it's a heel banger. Okay. This could be a good day to be doing this. You're swinging really nice and quickly, but you're not getting nearly as much out of it as we know you could. Uh huh. Okay, let's see. Not bad. Not bad. I'll tell you, if the boy could turn it over, it wouldn't be the worst swing in the world, but we can't. No help, no lessons. 157 ball. Yeah. You see above 160 today? No. <laughs> I like it. Want to bet? <laughs> 106, not 160. <laughs> oh. Couple more. Toy? Yeah. You need the toe. You need the toe. The toe is your happy place. Okay, pretty good. Thank so, God. in fact, it wasn't toe at all, it was thin. Oh, well, it felt like the toe. So, there's sort of your driver, and it's... Martin Short. Yeah, with some misses in there. We know you're creating a little bit of an open face to the path, uh, a little bit high dynamic loft because the face is open to the path. Junk. So, we gotta do some work in that. 
Okay, um, we're going to start off with standard Black Ops because the whole point of this video is to unlock the full uh, customization and capabilities of it. So let's put it in the rear side. Let's just see what we've got. Okay, Mikey, same commitment, full throttle. Okay. New Ventus, looks good on you. <laughs> Oh my God. I don't understand that, I really don't. Sounded quite solid. Yeah. Yeah, wee bit closer to the middle. Okay, good stuff. All right, Mikey. Let's see if we can transform this thing. I need my life transformed with a driver. Closer? Yeah, I guess. Not really. Not really. Okay, let's see. Um, yeah, nice improvement on the spin. Okay. It's actually starting to look much better. I know you're kind of fighting your swing a little bit, but um, it's actually starting to look quite a bit better. Very good. Money right there. What did that say that one carried? 260. What does it say it carried on there? 264. 2200? Yeah, 2200. Well, it's, remember, it's like, this is, I guess, set up for well, it looks better on there. Pacific and... How much better is this, though? Yeah. Yeah, no, it's definitely straighter. Spins way straighter. Lower. Way, way straighter. Like, those are not bad swings for... Not, like, awful swings, but bad swings for sure, and the spin's not at, like, mm. 5,000, which is nice. Okay, let's, uh, let's get the big dog in your hands. So I'm going to take the, uh, the standard head now. So, uh, you know, I think that standard tour, like you saw in testing, could be a really good head for you. But I ordered an eight degree Black Ops uh -huh. driver, which I've always been begging the company's ping to make their sort of forgiven models in lower lofts for yeah, us. Yeah, yeah. Because I think it just then allows us with our clients to sort of close the face without adding too much loft mm. and it still gives them a chance. People want to hit it straighter and take advantage of the adjustability, but they also want to hit it far too. Little, little trick and upright, low spin, low lofted head. Definitely. Okay, so Black Ops Tour was, was no. way better. Yeah, spin came down. Spin came down nicely, much flatter flight, obviously total change there, but I want to see if we can get a little bit more launch out of it. I think the Black Ops was uh, was decent at launch, obviously a bit open face. So this is but eight degree? This is eight degree turned a bit closed, which would be good in this case. 290, that's So if we look at, it's, it's exactly what we said, like take the best of all, right? Yeah. So for that launch, that spin, now we're starting to, look at where your driver was, 242 carry, 264 carry. And it's straighter. Yeah. Hmm. I'm surprised how low spin this thing actually is. Super low spin, isn't it? But it really launches nicely. Yeah. What's the weight configuration? 10 heel, 2.5 back, 2.5 toe. So actually down a little bit in terms of the overall weights. It's normally 12.5. Even that though. 14 yeah. to 26. Yeah, it's all right. I know we're obviously not like talking about shape and comparing shape, but uh, for it not to look like a draw bias driver. Totally. I know ego shouldn't matter, but ego matters, so. That spin and launch is definitely good. It's crazy, isn't it? Yeah. And it's exactly what you would want sort of for somebody who's kind of struggling a little bit to sort of decouple launch and spin. 
you need a head that's designed like this with loft that is low. Yeah, you, I, you just have to. The tour one was nice, but this is easier to for Way me to easier. turn over, obviously. Yeah, yeah, you can see it. Pretty good. You're right though, that launch and spin. So good. I'm shocked. I'm shocked how low spin this head is. But it's, it sits nice, it looks good. It looks really, I, I think it looks fantastic. Okay, good job, really good job. Um, so let's look at the comparison page just to kind of set the scene a little bit of what we were trying to show there. Mm -hmm. uh, you were struggling a little bit with the strike on yours and to be honest, the PXG Black Ops. Uh, when you first tried them, very yeah. similar numbers uh, in delivery and obviously in the result. Knowing that we could get your spin down with the tour head and sort of with that weight in the heel being much more sort of useful and, and effective mm -hmm. than, than really, you know, I'd, I'd say any other weight track out there. And that's even in the tour one. Yeah. Night and day. Yeah, totally. totally. I'm mean, that Black Ops tour. When I was fit for it at PXG, even when I played with it, I, we played that one round with it. Yep. I love the look of it, we mm -hmm. talked about it, but yeah. it, to me, a little too flat. And obviously, as people can tell, I struggle with a bit of path right now. So I don't love the flight, but it was low spinning for sure, that Black Ops Tour. Yeah, it was very, very low spin. Um, and obviously coming out in a very Flatter. different trajectory, yeah. right? Super, super flat. But that's where this little secret weapon is yeah. gonna come into it for so many people this year. High launch, it, low it spin. It launches up, yep. And, you know, again, weight in the heel like we had there for you. We were kind of playing around with 10 grams, 12 grams. I mean, with all these different weights, you know, we're talking about 10K and, and sort of obviously the driver forgiveness. You make this whatever you want it to yeah, be yeah. With, the, with the weight configuration. And I love that it's, you know, little single weights. You can split them up. You can do fives around the head if you want to balance it out. Mm -hmm. um, there's, there's all sorts of different options uh, that we can have, but... What I love about it is it is a truly unique head with that launch and that spin. Yeah, it's nice to see that launch go up and spin doesn't skyrocket. Again, there's a few what I would call slappy ones that I don't love to see the flight of, but a couple that are tight fades, tighter fades anyways, and they, yep. they definitely perform. And if we can start to look at, you know, some of the better strikes with it, and even just take Black Ops... Um, yeah, Black Ops Tour and, and Black Ops, like that's how I view these two drivers. Yeah. Right, how they, how they get the job done is one gets it done the high road and one gets it done in the low road. You take the high road and I'll take the low road. And I'll be in Scotland before you. <laughs> uh, I can see why the tour players gear towards um, just regular yeah. Black Ops. I can as well. High launch, low spin. Yes. Bigger, more forgiving, sa you know, the safety of the 10K. And I'll be honest, I didn't see it until I got hold of the eight degree. Mm. And that's why I really wanted that eight degree because I think the nine is good. And if you are a, a really neutral driver of the golf ball, I think the nine degree is fantastic. Mm -hmm. I tend to err on the higher end of spin. You tend to err on the higher end of spin. And actually that eight degree is something that would be really quite playable for both of us because we don't have to have the sacrifice and the distance with the spin, but we get all the MOI in the world. That is why I'm going to be as bold to say is I think that might be the best head out this year. So I'll play this one, and what are you going to play? We'll wrestle for yeah, it. Yeah, uh, you would. I don't want to wrestle. <laughs> I'll have a arm wrestle for it off camera. On camera, maybe. That'd be quite good. No, I've already been embarrassed enough. Um, guys, I mean, I really was excited about doing this test, and, you know, I'd been waiting for a while to, to do it, and actually want to, to go even further with this, because... I believe in this head that much. I want to do it against all the other heads that are getting all of the, the sort of praise in the testing. 10K bracket? A 10K bracket, I think that'd be great. Maybe something in the, yeah, in the, in the, in the Yemen style where obviously we picked four heads. Yemen? I know, we don't, oh. we don't mention his name around here anymore. Um, but the four heads, just pick four of the high MOI heads mm -hmm. and let's see which one comes out on top. This uh, PXG, if you're watching, you who? That's quite good. Very impressive, isn't it? I Maybe told you all. I told you all about that. What told me all about what? Uh, how it was gonna work? How it was gonna be so good? 
Oh, I tell you. What, what a life with a mentor like Michael. It's fantastic. <laughs> All right, guys. Um, so obviously the, the bracket showed you how good the tour was and hopefully this test will show you how good the standard version is. It arguably is, is far more effective for far more of you watching these videos. So I think people watching the bracket will, will maybe have draw, been drawn to the, the Black Ops tour head. And if you have high speed and you're looking for that really flat flight, definitely, I, I totally get it. But for the rest of you, the eight degree or the nine degree, depending on where you are, having the ability to bring that loft down, close the face a little bit, weight in the heel, as extreme as that plays, it's a really effective driver. I think it'll be good for a lot of people. The woods will be in our studios by the end of March. Fantastic. Canadian studios. Canadian studios. They're good. Yeah, I think they're in the US studios as I well. I think so, yeah, I think. yeah, yeah. Yeah. Good stuff, guys. Let us know um, if you've tried uh, any of the Black Ops drivers so far. I think... Lots of people are, by reading the comments, keen to try them. If you haven't already, make it part of your, your testing. Uh, we are going to do the 10K bracket, so uh, please stay tuned for that. Make sure you are liking, subscribing to the videos. Subscribing is a, a huge, huge benefit to us. We want to see the channel grow. We want to see, you know, hear you guys in the comments. Please let us know your thoughts on these videos. What would you like us to do more testing with the weight system? Would you like us to test different weight systems? Who has the most effective? You let us know. We'll get it done. Stay tuned for more. We'll see you again soon.